Hello, the radio of Aryan Plays here. So today, what we'll be learning here is quadratic equation slash formula. So when a person gives you a quadratic equation, uh, a teacher, somebody, or your parents, and they say, solve it. You're like, what is this? I don't understand. It's just a base. You just understand. Then we have to use the formula. So I'm going to explain to you this formula and the meaning of the and what is the meaning of quadratic so the meaning of quadratics is quadratics can be defined as a polynomial equation of a second degree which impl which implies that it compares that it comprises a minimum of one term that is squared it is also called quadratic equations so the formula for finding the quadratic equation is x equals to minus b plus minus square root b to the power of 2 minus 4ac divided by 2a. So like that's just basically a bunch of alphabets. We don't know how to do this. Well, don't worry because I'll get to that part, okay? So this is actually quite simple to memorize and, and the formula is simple. So each number has a variable attached to it, which will be a, b, and c. Okay, so you're like, oh, okay, I get it. Minus b, so that's the b. b Four, that's a number, okay? A, C. Okay, yeah, you're getting it. Like, you're like, a, oh, I think I might be understanding it. Well, that's good, okay? And now when we're moving on to the question right here, so the 2x to the power of 2 minus 8x minus 24 equals to C. Now, you guys see, underneath each of the, ch underneath each um, number, each, uh, each number, uh, I put a, I put an alphabet. That alphabet has to be right there. So you got the first set of numbers, like 2x to the power of 2, A. Then you got the second, 8x, B. Then 24, C. Okay? Do you have to order it correctly? Okay, like 1, 2, 3, A, B, Cs. Just like that, guys. Okay? It's just A, B, and C. There's no, uh, other, there's nothing else above C. Just A and B, C. Now when you're like, oh, okay, I think I might be able to understand x equals to minus b. Hey, minus b is minus 8x. And then plus minus square root b to the power of 2. Oh, minus 8x minus one minus 8x. Ah, okay. And then you're like, oh, wait, minus 4 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 24. Oh, okay. And then dividing it by 2 multiplied by 2. Like, and that's how you do it. You have to place the formula correctly and you just have to put the alphabets correctly in order. Now, now when we are trying to understand this, now let's get into the actual thing. So x equals to minus minus 8, that will be open bracket 8, plus minus square root minus 8 by minus 8 will be 64, minus 4 multiplied by minus 2, which will be uh, minus 4 multiplied by 2, minus 8, multiplied by minus 24, which will be positive 192. So the answer will be 8 plus minus 64, 64 plus 192 divided by 4. Because 2 on the bottom right here, where we see where my cursor is, we see that 2 multiplied by 2, which will be 4. So divide by 4. Now 8 plus minus 250 square root 256. Uh, so what we did was 192 plus 64. That's how we get 256. We're almost at the end, guys. Just bear with me. Now divide by 4. So uh, x equals 2. So what we here, right here, did was um, 4 divided by 8, which we, so 256 square root 16. Okay. And now what we're doing here is 4 divided by 8, which will be 2 plus minus. 4 divided by 16, 4. So right here, where we see here, x, uh, so x equals to 2 plus minus 3. You're like, what is plus minus? Well, plus minus means you can 2 plus 4, 6, or 2 minus 4. So we have to give both of the answers, not just one, both. Your teacher or whatever, or your piece of paper requires two answers, not one, two. Now, x equals to 6 minus uh, 6, and minus two six or minus two so thank you guys for watching this with me 
the please like and subscribe it helps the channel a lot thank you for all the seven subscribers thanks for liking it and please hit the notification on your way out kapish are you out